good morning good afternoon good evening everyone we'll just wait for a minute more for some people to get to join in and then we'll get started and go through the webinar thank you Good evening, everyone. So thanks for joining in in this webinar from iWave along with Crank. So where we are going to focus on how to accelerate the GUI and industrial application development on our i.mx8 industrial HMI solutions. So to give you an introduction, my name is Taufik and I head the product marketing team at iWave Systems, where I help customers in terms of the solution architecture and in more in the marketing and helping bridge the gap between the customer requirements and the technology. So along with me is Scott, who is the product marketing manager at Crank Software. And he has over 20 years of experience across multiple disciplines in the tech sector and is passionate about helping businesses ignite their inner desire for creating exceptional user experience. And to give you a brief background on Crank, so Crank Software, uh, now an Ametic company, is a global innovator in embedded GUI solutions that accelerate the design and development of modern UX for tomorrow's IoT and connected devices. And through the storyboard framework, Crank is poised to drive innovation and a faster time to market, wanting to deliver sophisticated customer experiences and helping brands deliver unmatched performance. And Crank, with decades of domain expertise, has been helping brands such as Coca-Cola, John Deere, and Wovork, who rely on the Crank solutions to bridge the gap between the UX vision and customer expectation. And Crank is now a part of Amitech Inc., who is a global leader of manufacturing electronic instruments and electromechanical devices with sales of approximately $5 billion US dollars. Now, going a bit deeper into iWave, so who's iWave? So iWave is basically an engineering services company and a product engineering organization established in the year 1999. So we work with multiple semiconductor suppliers such as NXP, Xilinx, Intel, and we are one of the one among the global leaders in the embedded computing platforms. So with the platforms and the portfolio ranging from system on modules to engineering services, to complete ODM solutions such as the telematic devices or edge AI gateways or the industrial HMI solutions, which we are going to dive a bit deeper on. So iWave's role is primarily driven by the mission to be a reliable technology embedded partner for companies across the globe. And we are headquartered in India and with a complete global sales footprint and have been serving customers for the last 22 years primarily focused on the hardware and embedded engineering space. Now diving a bit deeper on in the crux of this webinar is in terms of how do you build your high user, how do you build a high user experience for your customers and how do you fasten your GUI application development? So for this, so what iWave has done is in terms of building a complete SDK which integrates the necessary modules, the access peripheral interface for all the connectivity and the corresponding interfaces with the protocol support. So this SDK contains the cross compiler and the libraries. So it comes as a ready to use solution 
and this sdk creates an application in the binary that is copied to the target hmi through usb or through network connectivity and apart from this sdk i wave integrates this uh, provides the bsp that supports the drivers for the interfaces on this hmi solution which is built with the ready to use rootfs file system which is integrated with the protocols and the different corresponding input interfaces and this sdk is also also integrated with the cloud connectivity suite so when i say cloud connectivity suite in terms of your mqdt or your http protocols to communicate to your global servers such as the aws or the azure or the ibm watson the the hmis are integrated with these connectivity protocols and it is also integrated with the security suite so as i might touch upon later so since this solution is built on the idotmx state there is a powerful suite of security features available on this hmi solution which you can use to safeguard your connected device and your iot device and last but not the least is in terms of this sdk where we support the different ai ml frameworks and are looking to integrate multiple frameworks with your uh, tensorflow or cafe so the nxp supports the, the the processor supports the capability to integrate these from for uh, frameworks enabling you to create your ai solution at a rapid pace so uh, so as a crux what i mean to say is we do not give it only as a hardware solution but we give it as a software enabled complete solution which will enable you to build your quick user interfaces and build a user experience which en enhances the feature for the end customer and with this we also integrate the crank storyboard which i will leave for scott to cover in the in the later slides so now going a bit deeper in the connectivity and the protocols available on our hmi solution so let me just take it from the wired interfaces first so if you look at looking at it as industrial machines or in terms of your cleaning machines or your vending machines there are suite of wide variety of protocols available be it the rs485 the rs232 or the can interface and the ethernet interfaces so these are the interfaces and protocols which run through the complete industrial uh, frameworks and are, comp are embedded in our hmi solution and now help over these physical layers is how we build a complete protocol stack so in terms of the protocols we have the modbus rtu the modbus tcp and the j1939 stack integrated onto those corresponding physical interfaces so it comes as a ready to use solution with the corresponding apis for these protocols so you can connect maybe to a modbus slave over the rtu or the rs45 or through the ethernet so it, it it's a more like a plug and play device along with our sdk which enables you to get started with our hmi solution at no time and the in terms of the embedded connectivity available on the hmi we have the wifi and the bluetooth which come inbuilt on the device and we have the provision for an add on 4g module and the 5g module which helps you in terms of getting your hmi or your industrial machine connected to the internet and definitely in, the, in this industry 4.0 or the industrial iot solutions connectivity has been of rising importance so with this we provide the network connectivity options through the wifi bluetooth and an option through a m.2 connector to up to have an integrated 4g or 5g module and now talking about key features of our i wave hmi solution so let me just break it down into four key parts so the first is in terms of the processor scalability and the memory scalability so built on the i.mx8 so the i.mx8 is a very powerful microprocessor from nxp which is built for video and imaging applications and has the necessary high speed and low speed interfaces integrated with a powerful vpu and gpu integrated in the processor so for this the i.mx8 is seemed as a perfect fit for hmi and different sort of imaging applications which helps you build the complete end to end solution and this processor also provides the scalability across the the core so in terms of the single or a dual or a quad core it we have the complete scalability in the solution enabling you to get 
get started and help you build the right solution for the right requirement it need not be an overkill or an underkill so we make sure that the processor and the memory are fit as per the end requirements and are completely scalable and the second is in terms of ruggedness so definitely with the hmi finding of it in industrial applications or in the process automation or it can be on vending machines so there is a need a need for the protection for the display the touch panels and to withstand the rough industrial conditions and for example the chemicals or a water or the water leakage or to a very very rough environment in terms of the pollution so that is where the complete hmi needs to be fit for to operate in the industry temperature and the industry conditions and when i talk about industry conditions thermal stability is also an very key factor in terms of the different the thermal instability and the high temperatures the high humidity so these are, these are few key characteristics of a hmi which make it more suitable for the industrial applications and as a good fit of hmi for different solutions now complementing our processor scalability is our thermal solution expertise so the hmi is built with the heat sink the heat spreader so this enable so we take care of thermal characteristics of the solution so we take care of the complete thermal stability and in terms of the good processing power so making sure that there's no downtime of the device that is completely taken care of from i wave and last but not the least is in terms of the mechanical design so definitely different hmi solutions require different mounting different sort of enclosure different fitting dependent on the end application so as i mentioned ranging from the process automation to a vending machine to medical interfaces the fit is different across applications so you might need a rear mount enclosure or a panel mount or a flush mount or a wall mount so what i wave does is we have the complete option to customize your enclosure and make it suitable for the complete end application and we have the complete id design team internally so we take care of your necessary enclosure requirements and we enable the hmi to be fit into your requirement be it ip grade ip65 ip67 dependent on the requirement we can customize the enclosure for you so adding a bit on the value proposition and like what sets i wave apart is in terms of the hardware where we as i mentioned the complete scalability in terms of the processor the memory the connectivity the industrial interfaces so i will make sure that we are a one stop solution for your complete embedded hmi solution finding a fit in terms of the different interfaces required and helping you get started at no cost and the second is in terms of the complete the hardware architecture we help you in terms of the necessary peripherals and integrating your software or your application onto our device so i wave helps on the complete hardware plus software so in terms of building the sdk and integrating it with your application and the complete driver support for all the peripheral interfaces and i wave ensures a product longevity of a minimum of 10 years so we make sure that whatever we supply to you today it is supplied for the next 10 years and the complete bsp and the complete peripheral drivers are keep on getting updated on a rolling basis and a third is definitely in terms of the customization so where we post we have the complete that whether it's a display in terms of the scalability from the 7 inch the 10 inch to that will point 1 inch or in terms of the enclosure if you want ip enclosure or a wall mount enclosure or maybe a flush mount enclosure so that is something that i wave can always customize our standards off the shelf solution to suit your requirements and definitely in terms of the functional value so the whether it is thermal the th thermal characteristic the visual or in terms of some specific display characteristics i wave will take care of that since we have the complete ecosystem of the necessary partners and last is in terms of certification so if you require fcc or ce or some country specific certification i wave has a tie up with most of the global globally certified lab agencies to get the device certified for your requirement so that is it from my side from i wave so now i'll hand it over to scott to give you a brief intro on crank and talk about crank storyboard perfect thank you very much um 
Thanks to everybody for taking time out of your day to come uh, come listen to us talk today. Uh, if you have not heard of Crank Software before this presentation, uh, there is a good chance that at some point in time you have interacted with a product whose uh, HMI was built using our embedded GUI development software called Storyboard. So whether it's traditional markets like industrial, uh, medical or consumer markets where you can have find things like white goods, uh, IoT devices and wearables, the, the one thing they all have is they all share this common challenge when looking to deliver an exceptional and intuitive user, user experience on the device's LCD screen. And that is where Storyboard comes in. Storyboard was created by a team of embedded engineers over 10 years ago to really help make the development of embedded GUI applications uh, more efficient by removing the, the barriers that, that were there in place of traditional GUI development tools so that development teams uh, like those at iWave could really focus on making exceptional user experiences uh, through design, iteration, and testing. Next slide, please. So when it comes to it, why did you know, iWave maybe choose Crank Software Storyboard for the UI design development of their HMI solutions? Well, at the very heart of it, it was purpose-built for collaboration around user experience, around the UX. So as I, as I mentioned, it was designed specifically to help developers uh, work with designers to develop and iterate with ease in the quest for an optimal end user experience. And so when you think about it, you know, any device now that has an LCD screen, there is now this level of expectation by the person that will be using that device to provide that smartphone-like experience. And that's because we've had this powerful device with a responsive touchscreen in our pockets now uh, for almost 15 years, over 15 years. And so that has really set the bar now for any device out there that has an LCD screen, that there's a certain level of expectation that comes with it, of responsiveness, of, of engaging interactions. So it doesn't matter if it's something like a white goods, like a like a, a thermostat or a stove, or maybe it's a panel on an industrial um, device, there is still, whoever is going to be interacting with it has this expectation of simplicity, ease, responsiveness, as well as, you know, making it easier for them to go through the, the workflow or the flow of what's being presented to them uh, via that HMI solution. Also, Storyboard has this distinct separation of design and code environments. So its unique architecture decouples the front end design from the back end logic. And where this comes into place, it, it enables the team at iWave to really kind of get started on developing that HMI experience early while they're still developing the hardware platform that they're gonna marry it up with. So this enables them to, to develop, to test, and to update the HMI app and its logic at the same time in parallel without destroying the work or necessitating extra work that needs to take place uh, when changes are made. And so that really kind of flows into the next one, which is our unique rapid design uh, iteration and re-import technology. So one of the great aspects of the iWaves HMI solution is their ability to provide customization of the HMI app for you. So, you know, whether it's a unique color scheme to, to match your brand, or maybe it's, a, it's you want to change the layouts, whatever it is that you work with the, the folks at iWave to create, they can easily do that for you. And so, you know, to really find out uh, more, please reach out to them after the webinar and find out what they can do from a customization standpoint to, to really help you out. But Storyboard's technology is what really powers this and makes it possible to get it done quicker than traditional embedded development tools. So that way you can get your products in your hands a whole lot sooner. And then last, it's platform and OS optimized. And so what I mean by that, Storyboard's architecture really helps uh, de-risk the embedded projects by inducing, or sorry, introducing a framework that easily supports uh, technology and design changes 
at any point during the development cycle. So we work closely with the graphics teams, uh, the silicon vendors that we support. So people like NXP, which is provides the heart of iWave's HMI solutions to make sure that the tool's performance, but more importantly, our runtime engines are really optimized to take full advantage uh, of the board's processing power, um, or even take advantage of the unique specific features that are introduced on those boards, such as maybe uh, proprietary graphic engines, uh, 2D or 3D hardware, um, acceleration, maybe different the ways that they bring up different memory management uh, capabilities. But we work closely with them to make sure that the applications that are being created with Storyboard can really take um, the full potential in, in, of and, and of the of the hardware components that are there uh, to really make it easier to make sure that you know uh, the experience that you're looking to provide for um, or to obtain from iWaves HMI solutions are achieved. Next slide, please. So regardless of your unique we, uh, needs for your HMI um, solution control panel. The development teams at iWave and of course Crank Software can really help create an HMI solutions that are really designed to deliver exceptional user experiences. Uh, as I said, that from, from the ground up, our, our solution was really designed to help accelerate the development. It's that decoupled architecture that allows the, the HMI process or creation process to start earlier and not have to be always married up to the hardware in order for you to to know what's going on. But of course, you know, the sooner you can do that, uh, the sooner that you can really uh, fully understand the experience uh, that it's going to be provided. But more importantly, it's that ability to embrace those iterations. So to make those changes uh, to the HMI solution uh, that's being provided to you to really kind of customize it to your unique needs is one of the key strengths that really helps um, crank software store board kind of stand out in the market out there. And then of course, like I said, it's that UI flexibility. So the ability to, you know, change up elements of it at any point in time, which really allows uh, the team at iWave to really kind of enhance the solutions offerings as technology enhances itself. So it's marrying up that new technology, whether it's connectivity, uh, whether it's maybe taking advantage of new silicon, which provides you uh, more power in a more power efficient kind of standpoint, uh, but allows them to basically still kind of, you know, easily kind of get that solution to you quicker. So definitely, if you're curious uh, about more, learning about more about Storyboard, you can definitely check us out at uh, cranksoftware.com. And with that being said, I'm going to hang things back. Uh, thanks, Scott. So that was a very good introduction of uh, Storyboard and how it enables customers to build their HMI solution. So we are at the end of the webinar. So please feel free to post your questions in the chat window and we'll be happy to answer them. So Scott, we, uh, we have one question which I feel it might be relevant for you to answer. Mm -hmm. So do I need to have Storyboard in order for the iWave HMI to run? Uh, that's a good question. Depends. So the need for storyboard really comes into play as if, if you're doing uh, your own development. So because the folks at uh, iWave are doing the development for you, no, you don't need to have uh, access to storyboard in order for uh, the HMI application to run on your end. Uh, all the hard work has been done by the development team at iWave and everything that's needed in order to provide you with that exceptional user experience has been taken care of. So, thank you, Scott. And there's one question which maybe Sachin sir you would like to take. So, what is the OS supported on the highway HMI solution and what is the kernel version available at present? Uh, correct. The OS currently that is supported on uh, iWave HMI uh, Android as well as uh, Linux. Uh, uh, the kernel versions, uh, uh, probably John will be able to address it. But uh, let me just uh, let me just uh, uh, get that input. 
Sure. So I think John has sent a message. So we support the 5.4.24 kernel version currently. Let's uh, let's for the Linux, and probably he can put up for the um, Android also. It should be probably nine Android nine, I think so. Android nine or Android nine dot one. John. So uh, on the IMX eight, we have the support for the Android ten. Yes, we still have a few more minutes. So, so if anyone has any questions regarding the HMI solution or in terms of the iWave portfolio, please do feel free to post, drop a question in. We will send you a recording of the webinar and also the copy of the slides uh, in a day. And you can always feel free to take a snapshot of the current screen, which is your contact details. You can get in touch with me or Sachin from iWave or Scott from Crank. If you have any questions on the iWave and the HMI solution. Okay, so I, do, I think we, we don't have any more questions. So thanks, Scott. Thanks a lot for your time. And thanks a lot for attending the webinar to all of you. Appreciate your time, taking your, taking your time off. And definitely, please, we will send you a recording and do let us know in case you have any more clarifications regarding our solutions. Thank you. Have a good day. Have a good evening. Thank you. Bye-bye.